Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again Collectibles. Today we're taking a look at the Nano Hollywood Rides Collector's Diecast Series from Jada. This is Back to the Future, Back to the Future 2, and Back to the Future 3 Time Machines. As you can see, this is for ages 3 and up. And as you can tell, these are miniature uh, Back to the Future Time Machines. Very reminiscent of the Micro Machines of the day. Real quick. Real quick, I will show you a comparison between these and a standard Hot Wheels DeLorean Time Machine. It can the Hot Wheels can pretty much cover up all three of them for the most part. So let's go ahead and move that back out of the way. Warning choking hazard. Small parts, not for children under three years old. Alright, as you can see here, there's the Nano Hollywood Rides logo, the Jada logo, Back to the Future. Uh, again, we have the Back to the Future time machine. Back to the Future 2 Time Machine, and Back to the Future 3 Time Machine. On the back, as you can see here, it was made in China from Universal Studios. Uh, you can get a hold of them on Facebook and Insta Instagram. 2019 Jaded Toys. Uh, my wife just found these at Walmart today. Uh, it was the only package they had. She knows I like to collect... DeLorean time machines. So let's go ahead and open this up and we'll take a look at the DeLorean time machines from Back to the Future, Back to the Future 2, and Back to the Future 3. I may actually keep this portion. Maybe I'll keep this whole thing. Put them back in it just like that so that I don't lose them. Or maybe I'll just have it like this. Maybe I'll glue this on here and just display them like that. Something like that. I don't know. We'll see. But there you have this piece comes off. As you can see here, we'll go and set this over here. And let me grab my other ones to compare them to. All right, so first things first, we have the time machine from Back to the Future. Let's go ahead and take it out of here. There's the side view. Here's the Hot Wheels one. Very similar, down to the wheels, really. Here's a top view. Uh, the only difference, really, is the color of the engine. Uh, this engine's black, this one's gray. And the windows, this one's black. These are clear, uh, clear blue, kind of. We'll move this out of the way. Uh, and as you can see, they do have that same metallic paint, gray metallic paint scheme. Sorry about that, guys. My daughter had a question for me but there you have it there's as you can see there's the engine kind of hard to see on camera that's a better view right there there's the underside jaded toys incorporated time machine and the serial number very cool. Go ahead and slip that back in there. Now let's take a look at Time Machine 2 from Back to the Future 2. If I can get it out of here. 
actually no this is the still the time machine one no wait a minute I was right it's the time machine two only this one is a little harder to get out of the package and the main difference with this one is that it's in hover mode but it does have wheels on the bottom so it looks like it's hovering see that you can have it set on there now we'll compare that to the hot wheels time machine 2 uh, it is not in hover mode i have not been able to find one in hover mode uh, so i'll just keep trying to find them as you can see the main difference here clear windshield uh, the engine here is gray while the uh, fusion what's it called i forget the name of it i forget the name of it uh, it'll come back to me when I'm not thinking about it. <laughs> but the fusion generator from the uh, second movie is white on this one. Whereas on this one, it's the same color as the rest of the engine. It's black. It is there, as you can see. Uh, however, this part, this hose here is blue. Rather, on this one, it's the same color as the rest of, rest of the car. Um, there's the uh, wheels. The hubs aren't painted on this when it's in hover mode. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty cool that I finally got a, a time machine in hover mode. That's cool, even if it is micro machine size. But there's that one. And now we're going to go ahead and take a look look at the time machine from the third movie once again if I can get it out without damaging the plastic I had to push it out but didn't damage the plastic too much There it is, and we'll compare it to the Hot Wheels version. As you can see, the uh, part on the front is painted on the Hollywood Rides Nano version. Uh, on the Hot Wheels version, it is not. Also, on the Hot Wheels version, the Mr. Fusion. <laughs> see, I remembered it. The Mr. Fusion is once again painted white, while the Mr. Fusion on this one is the same color as the rest of the engine, black. Uh, now another one of the main differences between the two is on the Hot Wheels version, it has the white wall tires like it's supposed to, but on the Hollywood Rides version, it has red rims, it looks like. Which is accurate, but it does not have the white wall tires, which is disappointing. Uh, I can understand why it doesn't have the white wall tires, but they could have, they could, they, I think they could have painted the tires white. And it rolls around fairly well, not as smoothly as the Hot Wheels version. But still fairly well. Let's go ahead and get the other two back out. Compare them. All right. That one rolls around just as well as the third. And eh, the third one rolls around a little bit better. The hover from two 
rolls around a little bit better than the other two. So there you have it, guys. We have the Back to the Future DeLorean Time Machine from Back to the Future, Back to the Future 2, and Back to the Future 3, brought to you by Jada Nano Hollywood Rides. And we compared them to the DeLorean Time Machine from Back to the Future. Take care, geeks.